Hi, I'm Alex Deflang. I'm responsible for our digital selling strategy at Levi Strauss & Co. globally uh, in our wholesale business, so our B2B business. Um, reflecting on the current 2023 um, challenges in terms of customer centricity at Levi Strauss & Co. Um, I think it might be interesting to say 2023 is actually the 150th anniversary of our iconic 501. And I think um, not a lot of products, not a lot of brands can actually say that they've been at the heart of their consumers, in the minds of their consumers, and even on body um, for, for 150 years. So I, I, I see actually not challenges, but a lot of opportunities. Um, and I, I would take a few examples. First, keeping your consumers at the heart of what you do through the lens of your customers. Second, um, understanding your, your B2B customers to really drive deep um, relationships. And finally, harnessing the power of data. So when you think um, it's about how we answer and the demand of an ever evolving uh, consumer base at different shopping moments in across different shopping channels. Um, it's also thinking about the rise of new business models in our wholesale landscape. So when you think about department stores, starting e-commerce activities, when you think about pure players, marketplaces, and being customer centric is also understanding your customers in and out no matter their business model and helping them grow with your brand. And finally, the data, right? Um, data is actually the key to um, drive customer centricity at scale, to react proactively and even, you know, um, uh, and even more and to be closer to your B2B customers um, and ultimately to millions of consumers every day. So, I'm joining, I'm joining CB Commerce Next um, customer centricity high level group because uh, first of all, I think customer centricity is easier said than done. A lot of brands, a lot of people would argue that they are customer centric, but the key thing is actually to keep asking yourself, are you truly customer centric? I'm looking forward to exchange ideas, best practices, even between industries um, to unlock value for our customers and our business. And finally, I think customer centricity is, is it's a moving target, right? So it's a continuous um, exercise, it's a continuous learning. So I'm really looking forward to join this adventure.